This is our AccuSlide mock-up. As you can see, we have the left-hand side is made up with our G4 slide-out mechanism, and the right-hand side is made up with our hybrid mechanism. The way that this system works is that for any AccuSlide, we have the cables routed exactly the same way. As you can see, we have cables that are labeled out and cables that are labeled in. The out cables are your interior cables that pull the room out. The in cables are your exterior cables that pull the room in. If you look closer on these adjustment brackets, you'll see that the top cable on each adjustment bracket is labeled bottom, and the bottom cables are labeled top. Those are just in reference to which corner of the slide out room that the cables are routed to. As you can see that we have the outs in front on the left hand side and we have the outs closest to the wall on the right hand side. The reason for this is that we have single gearbox with a single drive shaft with two sets of teeth and these teeth spin in the same direction. So in order for the room to come evenly in and come evenly out, one side has to do the opposite of the other side. And the way that we accomplish that is how we route the cables. On the right hand side, the cables come from the jam to the corner pulley bracket parallel to each other without a twist. However, on the left hand side, as they come up the jam, there's a half twist made to both sets of the cables as they go up to the corner pulley bracket. That half twist allows the front adjustment bracket to be our outs and on the right hand side without that twist makes it to where our out adjustment is closest to the wall. As we retract the room, the in adjustment brackets are being pulled closest to the motor, therefore pulling on the exterior cables, forcing the room in. When we extend the room, our out adjustment brackets are now being pulled closest to the motor, therefore forcing the room out.